Have you ever wanted to tweak your monitor brightness? Well, I have this app called Twinkle Tray, which allows you to adjust each of your monitor brightness. Want to dim the middle one? Just drag. Easy as that. I don't understand why this is not an official feature yet. It's 100 times easier now with this application. I'm going to show you some cool applications and features that will make your life so much easier. You might want to stick around. You might have noticed I have a transparent taskbar. Well, Translucent TB does that for you. Just go to the Microsoft store and search for Translucent TB and install it. There are quite a lot of options here actually. You can make it transparent or even blur it, whatever you like. Got the boring wallpaper? I gotcha. Lovely wallpaper gives you option to add animated wallpapers. For example, I really like the fluid one. Also, the simple system is pretty cool. It shows you the CPU usage, GPU usage, and even the memory usage. Oh, and by the way, if you click this plus icon, you can add your own custom background. In macOS, you can click on any file once and then click space to peek inside. Well, it's now possible on Windows. I have this application installed called Quick Look and that does the exact same thing. Just click once on a file and then press space. You'll see a little preview. You can peek inside, for example, zip folders or even preview a video or an image. You can pretty much open any file type. I like it. Power Toys. Power Toys has huge amount of features. It pretty much gives Windows superpowers. It has so many features that it even might deserve a video on its own, but I'll give you my favorite ones. Command palette. You can activate it with Windows plus Alt plus space. It's useful for quickly searching and launching your applications, or even if you need to do fast calculations. I also really like the color picker. You can open it with Windows plus Shift plus C. Now just pick any spot you want to get the color from, and boom, you can now see the hex value, the RGB value, and the HSL value. It's pretty useful. Oh, and by the way, if you double click control fast, you can locate your cursor. It can be pretty useful if you have a peak monitor. There are plenty more in power toys, but I leave it for you to explore. What the hell is up with searching files in Windows? For example, I have this image in my desktop. Let's say I have lost this image, but I know the name of the file. And when I try to search for the file, let's see how long it takes. At the same time, I'm going to open everything. Let's see how fast it is versus default Windows search. So let's search for duck. It's instant. How can Microsoft make a search that bad? Anyways, everything is a good way to search your files if you have, for example, lost them and you don't want to wait for six hours straight. It's called everything for a reason because Microsoft can't do anything themselves. Okay, okay, I can't be that harsh. Recently, Microsoft added a new useful feature called clipboard history. So when you open settings, then go to system, scroll down and then clipboard. Check if you have this enabled, it's really useful. For example, let's say we copy a few things and now we want to paste them. I can just press Windows plus V and see it's all there. Also, I gotta give credit to Windows screenshotting. When I press Windows plus Shift plus S, I open the quick snip tool. I can take a screenshot of anything I want. That's nice. Also, when you click this little pop-up on the bottom right, you can edit the image as you want. Draw on it, save it straight away. It's pretty good. Next, I'm going to show you Windir stat, which shows what's eating your space with colorful blocks. Click on any of the blocks and it will show you the file. I found some totally useless stuff that is wasting some space. You can right click on any of the blocks and uninstall them easily there. It gives you a good visual overlook of the applications or files you have installed on your computer. There you go. That's some ways to make Windows better. I should just trying out Twinkle Tray. It's definitely a life changer. If you want part two, let me know. I have some other cool features you might be interested in.